All right, today I'm going to be showing you guys the best settings for Black Ops 6 to get the best FPS and for the game not to look too terrible. Now for the display part here, display mode. This is really, I mean, full screen exclusive, you will get more FPS, not a lot, but this really doesn't matter. I play full screen borderless because I tap out a lot and I can just easily tap out and back in. It really doesn't matter. Make sure your monitor is set to the right one. If you have several graphics cards, I just make sure you're on your graphics card, whatever. Screen refresh rate, make sure that's all set to the right stuff. All this really, a lot of this really doesn't matter. This is kind of just whatever. V-Sync, turn V-Sync off. Usually you don't want V-Sync on. Um, uh, custom frame rate limit, just custom. I just usually have it set to 300, doesn't matter. For the, for the menu, I like to keep it at like 90. So my GPU doesn't have to do way too much when I'm in the menu, you know, it's whatever. Uh, start with the quality here. So at quality, you want to make sure your render resolution is just at 100%, not over, not below. You know, my monitor is 1920 by 1080, so I just have it at 100. So whatever your monitor's graph, uh, resolution is, just make sure it's at 100 and you'll be good. Upscaling, I don't even know how you say these. Fidelity, Fidelity FX, it's right here, this one. I, I if you can also just play around with stuff like if you want to try a different one go ahead but this is what i'm using this is what i think has worked for me the best vram scale target it's 80 a rate shading i have that turned off i don't think it really matters now texture resolution i have that at low i think that textures resolutions just whatever i don't really care that much about how the game looks with textures texture filter now if you have like a mid to high end system put it at normal but if you're you know if your gpu isn't the best or you know your computer's just not very high end i'd put it at low but i have a 3060 so i'm fine with it at normal depth of field off nearby level of detail normal particle resolution normal but if you have a low end system put it at low bullet impact and uh, persistent effects off shader quality low on demand texture streaming just cut that at optimized and uh this i don't think this really matters i don't really know what any of this is i don't really care about that stuff oh make sure download limit is just off I mean, it's, it's down, on demand texture streaming is kind of dumb but uh, local texture streaming quality keep that out low shader quality shadow quality very low screen space shadows off screen space ambient lighting Let's go to medium on that one you can go to low if you have a low end system again but blah, 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 whatever screen space reflections off static reflection quality i have that at low tessellation off volumetric quality low deferred physics quality we have that off weather grid volume off water quality off that's what i have here for the quality settings uh i think this has worked very well for me the game runs pretty well now then again if you if there's uh, you can fiddle around with the stuff if you don't like how it looks or a bit of that you know just fiddle around a little bit for the view this is just mostly preferences but motion reduction i just have it off um but yeah it doesn't really matter to me field of view another preference 120 for me because i've always just played fps games with high um field of view ADS uh, affected, yada yada. It's all preference stuff. Motion blur, I would say please keep motion blur off. Um, but again, motion blur is just a preference. Uh, yeah, I just wanted to get through this video quick. I hate whenever people do these videos and they just go on and on. But um, I'll actually, um, I'll just get into, a, I'll jump into some gameplay. I'll let you see what the game looks like for me at least. And uh, yeah. So this is how the game looks for me. I have a 3060, I have a Ryzen 9 5900X. I get it between I'm sitting here, uh, you can see on the top right, I think you can, you can't see it on OB. Oh, no, I have it on top left, because uh, I play on Steam. But uh, yeah, I'm getting around at least 100. Probably if uh, there's a lot going on, I will get maybe dip to like 90 something. But the game here for me looks really nice. I think it f runs really well for me. But yeah, I think this looks really nice. I don't think it's, you know, I don't think it looks too bad. I think it runs well, and I think the game looks fine. And um, yeah. yeah, I'm sitting at around 120 here. So maybe I'll make a video about like my thoughts on it. If, uh, if you should buy it, if it's even worth it. I'm enjoying it right now, but then again, that's just, you know, the, the honeymoon phase. Every Call of Duty, you're going to enjoy it at first, but um, that's it. Yeah. Um, thank you guys for watching. I hope this helped and uh, see you.